Hey, what's going on guys? It's Fury. Today I'm going to be checking out Spirits Abyss for the first time. This is not a new game. It came out in 2020, but I think it's probably a hidden gem and that fans of my channel and Noita and just roguelite platformers in general will probably really dig this. So let's go. In lands long forgotten, stories told of a mountaintop that led to the gates of the resting realms. For it was believed a child cast into the abyss under the gaze of the blood full moon may one day return. But that child shall wield the unfading wealth and power over the undying... <laughs> yes, toss me in, mama. Let's do this. Spirits Abyss. Alright, uh, I guess let's do the tutorial. Ah, you finally hear my wee little honey bunch. It's time for your training to begin now, sweetie. Soon the chasm of the restless shall embrace you, and the glory of the clan rests with you, my child. Within the abyss you will face scary meanie nasties, but fear not, my little honey angel, I shall guide thee. Now I must confess, I can't quite recall your age. I trust you are fully beyond the age of crawling. Uh, yeah. Da, look at them cute little tooties whirling away. Now spring, my cherub, leap to heaven's gate above. Jump. He he, you didn't quite reach the celestial order, but a valiant effort, my cuddle buddle, I am proud. To reach higher places, try jumping off of walls. Press into the wall, then jump to spring off of it. Alright. There we go. Sweet. Superman, but let's give them twig arms a workout. Try climbing that rickety oldie ladder behind me. Alright. I already know how to jump down through platforms. The top ledges of walls can also be grabbed onto. Simply press into the side of this bluey wall. Alright. Good. Some platforms can also be jumped down through. Hold down, then press jump to slide on by them. I already did it. And now you're truly the ninja master maneuverer. So let's move on to some other cool stuff. Hee <laughs> hee. Deep in the, the abyss, you may need to plan your path. By holding up down, you can peek above and below. Nice. Alright. Spelunky. So this game's gonna be a lot like Spelunky. I could already tell. Got some burbs. Now, Pumpkin, you see all them juicy numbers up top? Try... They show your health bombs and treasure found. Alright, 4 HP. There's also a status page showing neat stuff, too. Such as all your items and a handy map to fill in. Status. Charmed Claw, the magical tootsie of a noble spirit wild's kin. Remarkable luck follows those that possess it. Map is A. <laughs> my lovely home, homie. Okay, where's my cat? Nice. And then question marks. All right, how do I get out of here? Uh, two minutes, sure. There are two types of items, passive and gear. Passives confer general boosts and new abilities. Gear has to be equipped from your status page. Try picking up and using this fancy family relic. Boom. Status. And then equip Y. Alright. Worn spade, a battered old diggy utensil still yearning to end its life, demolishing dirty mucky mud blocks. Alright. Uh, let's try digging over here because there's a chest. Hee <laughs> hee. Steady on, you diggly mucky pup. Gear have their own health, which reduces when they're used. All right. You're almost ready, my bibby pipsqueak champ. Let's finish with some boomified blasty antics. Each of the clans specialize in their own weaponry, our own great clan dis discipline uh, in huge hand cannons. Slap your merry mitts on it and demolish them spooks. Note it's capable of complete eight directional aiming. Noise, I'm using a controller. So, with D-pad, maybe I should use analog stick? All right. You were so eager to inflict pain on them souls, but let's talk about something dear to our clan. Gold. Ruddy, juicy chunks of gemmy treasures. The abyss is crawling with it in every clammy crack. Bombs are very useful for opening fresh paths, but best of all, you can get even more gold. Try bomb blasting this goldy encrusted bluey wall. <laughs> but stay back or the explosion might get you too. Alright, bomb. Yes. Most excellent aiming, my pookie pumpkin pie. And now the training is complete, you are ready. You shall serve great honor to this noblest clan, lest the resting realms bring comfort to thee. Now sleep, my most chosen child, for the full-blood moon shall rise with you. 
Oh, but I wanted to dig to the treasure chest. Man. Come on. Tutorial complete. Nice. Restless journeys await. Okay. Let's go. We got a thingy. Play. It's got co-op, too. And it had a pop-up for uh, remote play together. So, sweet. But we're doing single player. Lexicanium Hunt. Seek the ensorcelled tome of a librarium overseer. And then one, two, three, four, five, six locked modes. Grimoire Compendium. Scores, stats, and other collated spooky wisdoms. Abyssum Challenges. Play against the Abyss community and seeded runs. Nice. All right, normal run, I think. Choose your character clan. Alchemistro, renowned gunpowder chemist who specialize in magically infused big boomified hand cannons. I mean, come on. You, if you know me, we got to do that, probably. Katanachi, honorable Bushido, revere in the heritage art of noble and realm blades and experimental bombs. And then locked ninja, miner, bony body, conjurer, and slave to Emporium. So there's five locked classes and then a randomizer, random class. Yep. We're going to be an Alchemistro. To my Alchemist Angel. For it is whispered the restless hide librariums brimming with arcanic occult tomes of blasphemy. Seek such a tome, my child, and fetch its ciphers. But beware, for such an exquisite gift belongs to a dreaded overseer. Shall thy prize be worthy? All right, we're going to solve the eye puzzle right now. He he he. <laughs> okay, let's go. I don't know. There's a chest. Um, yes. 150. I don't know if there's a time limit like Spelunky. And of course, uh, this is completely blind, guys. So if you've played this, oh God. If you've play played this before, I almost, the jumping was a little strange. Just bear in mind that I'm playing this for the very first time. So, I mean, I could see this. I don't know. I'm probably going to die from something really dumb. I didn't die from fall damage right there, so that's good. Can I... Hang on, let me see if I could, like, kind of jump at the last second here. Or can I still get in... Ah, whatever. Let's bomb this. I got two more bombs. And so I can shoot down, shoot in any direction. I'm using D-pad, but I might switch to analog stick or mouse. Uh, it's just like the controls with keyboard were weird and there wasn't a default mouse option, uh, but I looked in the settings off camera and oh God, okay. Good, you're dead. And uh, you could turn on mouse aiming. I might do that, but I, I kind of... Oh, God. Mm. All right, good. I'm glad you only took one shot. Yeah, so I might switch to mouse, but uh, I wanted to just... I like using controller when I can in games, uh, when I'm able to. Are you going to die on fire? And am I going to be able to get that? Potentially. Oh. I need a stronger weapon. I have no idea what that is over there. All right, can I get up here? Crap. Let's do that, and then we can probably get it. Come on, do it. Whoa! Nice. Was that any item? No. Oh, dearie, my pockets remain wistfully barren. May the resting realms bless my journeys. All right, on the map. Okay, we'll look at that again, don't worry. Hopefully no chests, like, explode. And, you know, this game, I don't know if there's going to be crazy, like, chest mimics or anything like that. Uh... Hello? There's a Zambi over here. Let's go over here. I think that's a shopkeeper or something. Although, I don't know how to access you. I don't want to sh well... Foolish child. Okay. Yeah, I had a feeling this was gonna happen. I can't shoot very fast. Oh god. 
people who have played this game before are probably like, oh my god, whoa! Yes. All right, let's read the bestiary if I can. Uh, is there a way to access that? I, I don't think there is. Wait, maybe? Settings, Grimoire Compendium. And then commit seppuku. Bestiary. Uh, zombie. Uh-huh. Grave tender. Sleepy keepers debited to maintain children of the moon burials as they pass into resting. Okay, so it wasn't a shopkeeper, maybe. Haunt burials. Oh, no. Okay, whatever. Haunt burials is the place where I'm at. And there's a million... Where am I? Oh, God. All right, we have three HP. All right, no problem, no problem. It looks like that can be open, maybe, with a key. Potentially. And I don't know... I'm not gonna use a bomb up there. Let's just get this stuff. It's easy. There's a chest down there I saw. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna explode this. Because it looks like... Solic Jewel. Sullen spirits trapped within whisper for release. Worth a pretty penny if sold to a nice shopkeep. Choppy. Okay. So it's just something that's worth money. Oh, man. All right. Woo! Nice. I like the graphic style a lot, but it because it's so, uh, like, condensed style pixel art, I think, something like that. Like, it looks nice, but I'm like... Gotta get used to it so I see everything, you know, and not, like, walk right into traps or something. All right, uh, we have four bombs. So let's get this. And then, I don't know. I almost blew myself up, or did I? Is this... All right, let's see if we can... Let's go this way. I got... Well, no, let's just go. Uh, maybe. I is somebody there rustling beneath me? Alas, my eyeballs have been plucked free. I cannot see. I cannot condemn the poor dwellers who stole them. It seems my diamond eyes are a valuable commodity. Ho-hum, I would have liked to see a friendly smile. Boy, I have some at for ya. 2,000 gold. Uh, I don't know. There we go. We gave him his eyes back. What a joyous surprise. Almost as joyous as seeing your delightful smile, you generous tiny creature. Allow me to impart a gift of as thanks. Clamber into my moist mouth and I shall send you someplace nice. Moist. Um, I promise I won't swallow you. He <laughs> he. Sure, I can't do anything. Okay, let's go. Ooh. <laughs> Shroom shack. Oi, ya meat sack. Pick a mushy chesty. Its contents may help you on your way. Dude. This is like Super Mario Brothers 3. I'm gonna pick the one closest to you. Oh, jackpot, baby. All right, we got some coins. Can I open another one? Can I touch you with my fingers? My salad fingers? Uh, we can only do one, okay. What if I shoot you? All right, let's just go, maybe. There, I bet you can get up there. The shroomy aroma is messing with my melon. Is it time to leave this fungal dump? Um, sure. Stage complete. Nice. All right, we didn't die. Telephone, your clan bestows a gift. So we got necrosis enchant, boost bomb explosivity into boomier blasts. Right. Missiled enchant, compacts bombs into wall busting missiles or Focalic Incant. Improves shot firing distance and accuracy. Let's get shot firing, I think. All right, Slimes Mire. Mabants. Nice. So I think I could shoot really far now. That's nice. I do not know if... All right. I'm afraid of... Oh. What are you... Are you going to kill me? You probably are. Probably are. So far, I like it. A lot. Um, I think maybe I want to catch that. Alright. Can I shoot you? Come here. 
Ow. No, never mind. We probably can. I'm going to bomb you. Yes. And you didn't drop anything, though. Never mind. I thought maybe we would get some kind of fat loot for that. We have zero bombs. That's amazing. Hopefully we don't need one in order to uh, leave this place. All right, you're probably going to shoot something at me. Or just drip goo all over the place. Are these... Yes. All right. Get some loots. There's a bunch of bubbles. You grew back. That's amazing. Burst that bubble. So I haven't gotten an item. Like a, any piece of gear or anything like that. Right? Do I have to equip? Oh. Uh, no, I can't equip it. Okay. Yeah, it was already equipped because I noticed right away that my... Ow. Notice right away that my uh, shots were going further. All right. I don't want that thing to grow back and one shot me. Or that's gonna one shot me, yeah. For some reason, wow, holy crap. The restless consumes the, this death screen is amazing looking. Uh, we died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here lieth the fallen child of Clan Alchemistro. We got up to the second floor, or whatever. New hunt, right away, let's go. Get me back in there. All right, my bunts. Let's try to move faster this time. But yeah, the graphic style, I love it. But it makes it look more friendly and not as deadly as like Spelunky, for some reason, with me. All right. Uh, now we get an item. Sef Seraphis Feather. A magical feather plucked from a restless seraph. Confers an additional jump even when groundless. Yes, please. I have a double jump. Hell yes. Okay, I'm glad I died now. This is the run where I'm gonna get to the third floor. Get to the second floor again. <laughs> Without exploding myself, please. Uh, hey. Who are you? Wait. Sure. This tent is jam rammed with supplies. If I'm quiet, my rummaging may not wake the sleepy guard. Dare I try and pinch a nice knickknack? Okay. Be very, be very, very, whatever. Be quiet. That didn't sound very quiet. A lovely bit of pilfering, chalky bar, <laughs> delivers an energy boost. Okay. I stole a chalky bar. Equip. Alright, a delicious milky caramel ingot of chocolate, packed with energy and an intense sugary rush. That sounds really good. I want some chalky walky. <laughs> oh man, this game's making me... Okay, I I'm glad there's no fall damage. I had to test. Because I totally intended to fall that whole way, guys. Wink, wink. Uh, you're gonna get bombed and not killed foolish child Yeah, 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 yeah Yeah, you're dead How do you feel about that? You don't feel that that good do you because you're dead. You don't feel anything anymore What is that a piece of chocolate? Uh, Baddie card. Oh my god. Yes, there's a card game in this too. So not only being like a spelunky, uh, like dungeon delving platformer roguelite, there's also a card game that we have to try to, I don't know. There's some NPC I think we have to try to find. What is this? Pixie compass sparkles the abyssum's dusty path. Aha, uh -huh. so that's just a, yes. A humble magnetized device enchanted by fairies. Said to sparkle the abyssum's dusty path downwards. <clears throat> Alright. Exit that way. Is that a exit mimic? What the hell? Okay, I'm glad that that looked a little bit sus. Uh oh. Well, we're going down. Spocker's Reckoning. 
Hey you, you smelly welly bully. Think you tough cherub picking on me chums, what? Well, you muppet, it's payback time for you. Ha ha he he wah ha. Okay, we have a boss? No? Oh, it, it is a boss, sort of. Okay. Oh god. I have one HP left. Yeah, um, it's a little bit hard to aim at the moment. I might use mouse controls. Scully Ghost card. Bluk you. Blue win blue. Take me stash, please. No more hurdy. Alright. Thank you. But we need HP somehow. The graphics remind me of Celeste. Especially this part. Because it's like a... Ma oh. Frozen mountain. And... See? Oh, no, it just went... Okay. I heard that there's a lot of content in this game. Like, a ton of content. And it's getting an update. On Monday. So... Yes. So... Lots more content on the way. Let's start over here. Noble Escort, Guardian Mecha that fires upon Master's Will. Focalica and Camp, improves shot firing distance and accuracy. Teleport Beamer, beam me up, Scotty. We gotta get this. Get that. I don't know if I have to equip it. So we made it to the second floor. We only have one HP, though. Okay, look, we have an option. That's amazing. Uh, We have a Chalky Bar. Let me try using that. Nom nom. Oh, we healed! Yes! Yes! And I moved faster, I think. And there's this... Very cramped quarters right here. The bombs. We got 14 bombs. Puff puff pant. Oh, so I have a sugar crash now. Excellent. <laughs> I'm moving slower, I think, now. Alright. Bop, 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 bop. Red Punk. Found a new enemy. Uh, oh yeah, and look down, please. Um, so... Oh my god. Well... Just one shot is enough. This game is cool. I like this. I've played uh, one of his other games, Anthony Case... Caseware, Caseware. He made uh, Streamium Immortally, I played, which is like a, a Gungeon style, sort of, sort of Gungeon y style roguelite. And he's got, I forgot the name of it, but he's working on like an actual roguelike, turn based roguelike coming out. And I just, I got a plenty of bombs, so I figure. We're probably going to die by the time I use all these bombs, so might as well use them, right? There's all these bubbles here, but having double jump is insane and very nice. Alright. I don't know what that- Ow! Alright, we have two HP that took two. Oh god, okay. I wish I had another chocolate bar, man. Oh, okay. I almost blew myself up, but I didn't. We're gonna check out this. We got a, some kind of maggoty thing that I can't kill, I think. Unless maybe bombs. Um, okay. Yeah, I had a feeling that wasn't good. It didn't look good. Let's just go down here. Uh, time is, I mean, music is slowing. Oh, jeez. Let's get out of here. Just go. Alright. Go over here. Please don't explode my face. And... Let's go. We made it. <laughs> I just... We're gonna die probably really soon, but whatever. I just wanted to do a short video checking this game out anyway. We got the time... We could play this on stream and get really, really good at it, too. Necrosis Enchant. I don't know if this game has any mods, either. Boost Bomb Explosivity into Boomer Blast. I'm probably gonna blow myself up with that. Crystalline Incant. Allows shots to ricochet off obstructions. That's awesome. Necrosis. Boosts your shot damage destructivity. 
Hmm. Or, wait. Oh, yeah. So, I also get healed a heart with one of these. So, you have to choose. Your, this one doesn't heal me at all. Ah. I remember reading something about that, that you have to choose your upgrade based on... Sometimes you, you'll take a lesser item because it heals you more hearts. Let's get the ricochet shot. All right, Fallen Sanctum. And we have, you know, this option, too. I don't know, are these gonna... Oh, okay. Woo! I might, uh... Well, I'm gonna stick with game or controller for now, gamepad. Rip. I'm just always assuming that things are gonna like fall down and kill me, you know? You're probably going to, right? Yep, you totally are. Alright, I'm gonna go over here. There's a big gem right there. Maybe. Uh, can I shoot it? No. I'll use another bomb, why not? Alright, back this way. Hey. I don't know if I can kill you at all. And I think this game probably has a lot of secrets, too. Let's go over here, where we can possibly not die. Alright. Thank you for not spawning an item, I mean an enemy. So our chalky bar is gone, right? We get this, we got that. Nothing to equip. Okay. <laughs> chalky bar, man. There was a Steam review of this game, and it was like... Uh, the, the writing is like a child wrote it. It's like this stupid language, whatever. And then the developer actually responded. Like, he, the review gave it a... I'm gonna show the review right now. He's like, ah, oh, this is dumb. It's the type of game that would have an item, a diapy wipey for your poopy whoopies. And then the developer was like, oh, good idea. And then added that with a screenshot. Diapy wipey for your poopy whoopies. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. What? Oh my god, really? So I believe that we might be running low on time right now in the game, maybe. Come on, don't jump off. The wall jump is a little finicky. Or not finicky, but... It activates pretty quickly. Uh, yeah, I knew one of you was gonna attack. Got four bombs. Let's get this at least. Midas touch. Enemies may drop a coin upon death. Sweet. Here, let's test it with you. Woo! You cheats. Shooting through walls and stuff. Look at that, that's two coins. Nice. We got a key. Whoops. I definitely want that. Rusty key, pray tell what secret may be unlocked. Oh. Hmm. Three bombs left. I'm afraid of this guy right here. Oh, you're not even gonna attack me, I think. Alright. There's something... Right there, that looks very friendly. Oh, what? Oh my god! Well, I was not expecting that. The restless consumes thee. Well, we got up to the third floor. Got a, a very small taste of this game, and look, we got a high score, first place. Local, locally. <laughs> Anyway, thanks guys for watching. I hope you're having a great day, and I'm uploading this while I'm away, out of the country. So if you have any comments and stuff, just hate mail, whatever you want to do, it's fine. I love you guys, though, but uh, I'll see ya. Enjoy the rest of your day. Please be safe. 
and I'll see you next time. Have fun. Peace.